As an avid indoor rower, the idea of being able to relive my previous days of rowing on the Charles River in Boston or along any other river in which I've rowed always captivated me. Now with the use of the HTC Vive, Vive Tracker, and a custom environment created in the Unity game engine, I can now transport myself to actually row in any environment I can dream up. The Concept2 indoor rower mimics the rowing action of a real boat with a handle in place of the oars and a sliding seat which is also a part of an actual rowing boat. The HTC Vive Tracker supports the HTC Vive with two hand controllers by being yet an additional element that can be tracked by the HTC Lighthouse system. In this application, I have it attached to the indoor rower's handle. Using the Unity game engine, the tracked Vive Tracker is linked with scripts that control the rotation and translation of the oars. To further enhance the experience, the initial position starts in a static state with no movement. It's not until the virtual oars are pulled through the water that the virtual boat becomes propelled, again linked with scripts in Unity to manage position and speed. As with many of my initial tests with the Vive Tracker, I've encountered a few instances where tracking may have been blocked by objects or challenged somewhat to be consistent or stable. However, for the most part, it's proven to be a very capable element for tracking. Aside from finding opportunities to stabilize tracking even further, I aim to continue enhancing the virtual environment with more interactivity, such as a heads-up display, similar to the one on the actual indoor rower that informs distance, speed, and other metrics. Other goals include integrating character elements, such as the rower's legs and arms in the virtual environment and to generate a few other environments for rowing. Without a doubt, this has been one of the most fun projects that I've had a chance to work on. And it simply spawned from a, a day of using the indoor rower and imagining rowing on an actual river. So when the Vive Tracker became available, I immediately saw the application and jumped to the challenge. Having immersed myself in this experience has shown me that indoor rowing is an activity that can benefit from the enhancement of interacting with a virtual environment. This has also strengthened my appreciation of the Unity game engine as a platform for developing integration with the HTC Vive and creating these virtual environments. I'm really looking forward to seeing this particular virtual rowing application develop even further and coming up with new places to row.